Hello guys, how are you? Why is your laptop having a limited lifetime? Not because of these acts. What, what am I doing? But because of the BGA balls, maybe you're not familiar with the term. These BGA balls are basically some microscopical balls that are made of tin and the um, microprocessor, the um, video card chip, the north bridge, the south bridge and media, many other chips inside your laptop or your mobile phone are actually resting on these pins, they are resting on these balls. Not always, sometimes the microprocessor, as in the case of this motherboard, is located on this socket right here. This is how it looks like uh, at a closer look. Um, and some of the chips, they can have up to 300 or even more of these BGA balls. Now, imagine that your... Um, microprocessor is constantly heating up and cooling down and this heating up and cooling down creates an expansion and contraction movement and if you expose your motherboard to this uh, regime long enough it will create some small tiny cracks in in some of these balls and if one of these balls it gets interrupted um, your laptop will stop working so this is how a um, microchip looks like when it's placed on the motherboard this is a close-up view and a section looks like this now if you look up closely you would see that there are very small cracks inside of this uh, motherboard right here and if you have one of these tiny cracks, nothing will work in your mobile phone or in your computer. Basically, your device will become bricked and you will not be able to use it anymore. Another thing is that the motherboard of the computer or the motherboard of your mobile phone, it's basically made up like a sandwich with multiple layers, with multiple conductive layers separated by some insulating layers well because of this continuous uh, e expansion and contraction of the motherboard these layers are swelling up and falling down exactly like like in a sandwich until they will break something inside and this will happen after a few um, years of functioning like this in this manner and these layers are connected with some inner tubes that are drilled inside the motherboard and these inner tubes are called viases. Now, if you expose your laptop to heat for a longer period of time or if you expose your laptop to humidity, these traces or these viases will get corroded after a, a few years and they will end up looking like this basically interrupted now some of these bga balls are connected through um, these tiny tubes inside the motherboard with other traces and because of this continuous movement this continuous microscopic movement of the motherboard eventually these tubes will crack and they will look like this this is a microscopic view of a section through one of these vias tube. Now I'm very glad I was able to explain you a little bit why your laptop or your mobile phone has a limited lifetime. And I'm addressing this problem because more and more people I see having um, devices that are six years old or even older and they expect that these devices will last longer than this and when I try to explain them uh, that they have a limited lifetime they don't seem to understand and um, when these devices are breaking eventually they are trying to recover as much as they can um, in matter of information uh, that they have inside of them or they try to repair them and this is basically impossible in some of the cases. 
so i really hope you enjoyed my video and if you liked my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this thank you very much for watching until next time see you guys Thank you.